Well, good day. Glav here. Welcome back and thanks for checking back in. And please remember, if you haven't subscribed already, please do. This is a two-day, 587-kilometer ride. On this one, we overnight near Muckham in Chanterbury. Beautiful roads cutting through the jungle, and if not through the jungle, through lush agricultural lands. A lot of durian growing out there. Beautiful spot. We return via the track area and we try and follow the coastline as best we can. We follow along like Kung Wyman Beach area, etc. It's beautiful beach and coastline line along this area, except that it was pissing down with rain on our return. But hey, what can I say? It is the bloody rainy season after all. This is another beautiful, scenic and twisty ride. Not many boring highways on this one, I've got to tell you, so I can highly recommend it. Thanks, Bebsy, for the top ride. Hope you enjoy it like we did riding it. Happy days. Here we are screaming around one of our favourite roads, around Dock Cry Lake or Dam. More of our favourite back roads down on the way to Maypim. Love them. So we've been riding an hour, found an old coffee shop we haven't been to for a few years, done about a hundred clicks or something like that, time for a coffee, tea, whatever. Nice little spot this. There's always got to be a bit of dirt on any of our rides. Bebsy and I are just strolling down the main beach road of Maypim. What a simply beautiful day and a beautiful spot. So we're about halfway there and we're down at Coffee Rider at Maypim. I've seen this place before in one of my previous videos, pretty cool joint, good food, good drink, happy days. We are now heading through the Pracy district of Rayong province. Nice roads through here. Hooting through the Muckham district in Chanterbury province. This is really nice out here. So after 300 kilometres, here we are somewhere in the scrub in Mackham. 
Very pretty countryside, I must say. Lots of durian farms around here, but the jungle's beautiful. Very tropical indeed. Uh, we're staying in a resort called, what's it called, Bebsy? Anatooka. Anatooka. Homestay. And home, Anatooka Homestay. You can see the little homes that you get here. Um, restaurant only open till six o'clock at night, so as you can see, it's not six o'clock yet, and we've been into it because we've got no choice because we're a long, long way from anywhere. Having said that, apparently I'm a bad influence on people because Bebsy's having the first drink he's had in fucking 20 years, and I didn't even have to twist his arm, so if he says I did, that's bullshit. Right? So anyway, happy days. So this is our little bungalows, uh, cost us 1400 baht each, nice bed, little telly, little space, your own space, little desk, modern bathroom, modern bungalow, 1400 baht, happy days. The afterbath from last night doesn't look good. Nice places. Has both cabin sort of accommodation and hotel accommodation. Nice big pool. We're about to go over to the restaurant. Lots of facilities, but of course. It's COVID. There's no way. Water's crystal clear. Heading back through the Makam district of Chanaveri province. As I said earlier, this is beautiful lush country through here. Riding along the coastal roads of the Trat province, very picturesque through here. I'd love to buy some property here. Those houses on the left are built right on the beach. Still heading through that trat area, the shame about it is it's pissing down. They're really nice roads through here. farms on both sides of the road. Here we are caught at a uh, COVID checkpoint. They took our temperature. What a waste of absolute time and resource. Back on our favourite back roads. We always go on this road on the way back. From May Pim, that is. Well, that's the end of our Mackham ride. Just shy of 600 kilometres. Thanks, Bebsy, for a great ride. Hey, people, remember what I always say. Life can be ever so short. Therefore, live life today. <laughs>